What's going on, everybody? Soliaka here, and I'm going to tell you this thing goes from zero to 65,000 miles per hour in 30 seconds. So let's get into this video. I do want to give a huge shout out to James Madison. There will be a little clip in there from his channel explaining the Florida law, but yeah, let's get into this video. Don't forget, hit that like, share, and that subscribe button, all that good stuff. And I hope to see a lot of you on October 18th at 5.30 at the Levin Law School building. All the links will be in the description. And um, I'm out. Soli Ecker, deuces. You're under no obligation to answer any of his questions. What did you say? You're under no obligation to answer any of your questions. Are you serious? Yep. Called Fifth Amendment. Oh, really? How yes, would sir? you know that? I've watched. And you know I what? Know. I have I have the right to ask you a question. I need to see your ID because you didn't cross that street in a crosswalk. I need to see your ID right now. I, I need don't to see think your ID. so, sir. If you don't give me your ID, I'm going to arrest you for resisting arrest. You crossed the for street. For resisting arrest. Re resisting where's, or impeding. Where's the there a car? This is there's a no, There's no traffic. This is where a am I impeding? I'll take this charge. Where no, am I impeding? You're going to identify yourself. Probably six or four central. Hit me with a white male detain. Send me another unit. So you you really you really think that I don't have a right that that it's legal for you to cross without a crosswalk? Not with anybody else. Okay. The crosswalk down there. That's the reason I was stopping her. There's traffic. What's that? There's traffic. I'm not debating this with you. I'm telling you what the Florida law says. That when you cross the street in Florida. Let's take a look at the Florida law. In order to be required to cross at a crosswalk, you have to be between two signalized intersections. The road that he's at here is one signalized intersection and a dead end with other houses on it. The law does not require you to cross this roadway at the intersection here, and in fact, there's no sidewalks in this road. This is very similar to what happened with an Acura Amanda, and this deputy made an unlawful arrest. That's why I was talking to her, and then you wanted to insert yourself in the conversation. So do you want to go to jail for resisting an officer in the presence of my official duties, or do you want to identify yourself? Because when you go to jail, if you don't identify yourself, you'll be booked under John Doe. And that vehicle that you just came from will be taken. Your choice. I'm giving you the opportunity. <laughs> and this gentleman, he was arrested. Um, he was charged with whatever bullshit that they charged him with. And then... Uh, he goes to first appearance, pleads not guilty, um, and a few weeks later, uh, it's all dismissed. Um, I will have links to the Volusia County Sheriff's Office if you're going to redress your grievances. Um, do it politely, but I can't tell you how to do it. I'm just saying, if you're going to do it, I'd always say polite is better. But hey do you, you know what I mean, that's all I can say about that, I don't care how you do it, but anyway, um, yeah, crazy video, and uh, all for trying to help, I, I believe they were homeless people, and that's what they do around Volusia County, and a lot of other places, they prey on the homeless, because they don't have a voice, and this gentleman was the voice for those homeless, so, I'm out, Soliacker, deuces.